control the lobs. Upstairs to Alex Tires for the alley oop slam. Colo Quinn caught in no man's land. They need to take better care of the basketball. Real Madrid haven't committed one yet. So no surprise that they lead by 11. As Labravatola goes to eight points. Tires goes to the rim. They skip. Fine tires. Misses the layup. And here comes Brand. They've got time. If he can get over half court. Dumps to Quinn. And O'Quinn gets the slam. Great court vision by Lorenzo Brown. Nicolo brings it up. Drives. Flips it back. O'Quinn. Throughout. Eddie answers for Fanabache. Colo draws the foul and one magical play by De Colo. Real Madrid once again squeeze the life out of this game slowly, slowly, in no rush. Yui shows why as he makes another three. Left the offensive fireworks of first quarter and a lot less so far here but they pick up his deck gets the M1 excitement building in the hall as Fenner have a chance to the colo and he makes the three Labravatola, who just continues to cause trouble. Eddie throws it away, and Labravatola has the easiest of jobs to get two points at the other end. And that's a mistake that Coach Kokoskov could do without. And for his offense, so Quinn misses the jump shot. Finds Brown for the back door, slam dunk. And the Bacha haven't put a lot of pressure on the ball handlers. They've been able to get any pass they wanted at any time they want. As Deck hits another one. Victory in Madrid in the first round of games. And dominance here in the final game of the regular season for both squads. Well, of course, our percentage was good and was part of the key. I think our defense was even more important. Uh, and of course, coach, the beginning of the fourth quarter where you uh, maintained that lead, Ben Fenerbahce coming back, 15-0 run in the fourth quarter. So how did it help you for that? Yes, I think we were very solid 40 minutes, but it's true that at the beginning of fourth quarter was when we make the run and, and we could finish the game.